So for this hairstyle, you want to make sure that you have a couple of things set up properly. One is the haircut itself. So Johnny Depp, you know, had this like very kind of messy, somewhat layered um, type of look, very textured, but it doesn't have to be super complicated. So the first thing is the hair type. If you have wavy to straight hair, this is going to be really, really ideal for you. Uh, as you can see, the hair length comes down to probably about the lip right in through here. And <clears throat> keep in mind that the hair, when it dries, had a has a tendency to shrink up. So a lot of times in his looks or in, in when he had his hair, it looked like it was a bit on the damp side. So that's why it looks and appears to be a bit longer. Okay, but you need to make sure you have the right length. So it could be whether it's down to the lip right in through here or bottom of the nose, that's definitely something that is essential. The sides, right? Everything should come probably about right in through here, okay? Right to the middle of the ear. Now, the next thing that's important is the layering. So all of this needs to have, I would say, you know, longer layers, not heavily, heavily layered because you don't want to have really short pieces up here and this really long. His hairstyle is something where you run your fingers to it and if you have too many layers, you know, it could cause a problem. So you want to have just the right amount of layering to remove weight. We're not looking to create really, really short lengths on top. So that's, that's really important. Next is preparing the hair for this style. And that means we're going to talk products. So it all starts from the shampoo, whether you're using my pure set, my pure shampoo and conditioner, or the volume shampoo and conditioner, which I would suggest if you're looking to get a little more volume. Next up is I'm always, 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 always going in with 25 spray. It's my number one selling pre-styler. Very, very popular on the internet. So a couple of spritzes of that. And then I'm gonna be using this vent brush, okay? I also sell this on my website. And if you use code YouTube20, you get 20% off and it's also free shipping in the United States. So I always, always use this brush for brushing through on longer hair. It's got a rubber grip. You're not gonna have it slip out of your hands. So once you have a 25 spray in there, the ease of combing through, it's like butter. Right, so this is really, really great for working on longer hair types. This glides right through and also helps get rid of the knots. <coughs> Excuse me. Next is Tidal Wave. Tidal Wave Sea Salt Volumizing Hairspray. It's literally my best selling product. So, one, two, three, four, five, maybe one for good luck. Anywhere from four to six spritzes is what you want to do. And then you can either use your fingers to rake it back or you can comb it all in to get even distribution like so. And then what you want to do is you want to actually start to kind of part the hair where you want it. All right. So let's go with kind of like an off center parting. Johnny Depp's hair seems to always kind of be either more like a center type parting or a little bit off to the side uh, this way. But what's important is that you have the product worked in. Now we're going to blow dry the hair. And what I want you to understand is I'm just gonna blow dry this very, very lightly, all right? Because um, you want, his hair always tends to have a bit of like a wet look. And this is just a way to get some of the moisture out. So what I'm doing is I'm just gonna like rake with my fingers. You wanna rake and you don't wanna like, you know, make it a big frizz ball. But the best thing is, is to rake with your fingers in motion with the nozzle in through here. You don't want to have dripping wet hair. So lastly, to create kind of that wet look, we're going to go with Shadow, which is a great product for giving it that kind of tech, that lived in texture. It's a cream, applies very, very easily. So you want to work it into the palms of your hands. Well, it's still a cream consistency. And then what you want to do is just start to work it in. All right, you want to work it all directions coming forward down this way, back, and what that's going to do, it's going to actually create that textured look like how Johnny Depp has, and you want to let it air dry. So you don't want to dry this fully. You can if you want, but really Johnny Depp's hair is all about having like the pieciness. So if you want those pieces, then you can just mold them and shape them in with your hand like this. All right, and as you can see, the hair doesn't have a definite part, right? And that's what's awesome about his hair is that when you create this look uh, and, you, and you just try to achieve this with your fingers, 
it's going to come out really, really great. Uh, and, and Shadow is really an amazing product for something like this. Let me just spin around this way so you can see. Right? Looks awesome. Again, if you want to have those pieces even longer, just pull them down like that. It's all about creating that texture on your own. And, and it's very easy when you're using products like Shadow and the ones I suggested because you can get that look in a matter of minutes. Then I would just let it air dry, set it, and forget it. I also have other tutorials like this, lots of like Leonardo DiCaprio. Uh, I have a lot of haircuts and hairstyles similar to this. Just browse my channel. And you can also, again, use your code YouTube20 at shop.thesalonguy.com.